Ronaldo. Let's start off with the biggest of all transfer rumor people, right? Let's let's switch over to our Ronaldo segment, right? Mm -hmm. Um, We are one week further along into the transfer season. Um, Not a lot has changed from last week necessarily, but the rumors are vacillating back and forth, right? You read one paper, he's staying. Next paper, he's leaving. One paper, he wants you know, an extension, additional years to make the salary lower, but make the years more. Well, what I had to le- today, the later is, is, uh, is he going to stay, but you know, you're not going to renew. Yeah. So, that, so yeah. that means he didn't accept the two years. Yeah. It to just put about a 20 million at 20 million. So, no. So, so I'm, uh, he, he, show, he went, he practiced, but he didn't show any enthusiasm. I think he still want to go to PC. So I think yeah. he might go. T- today was his first day back with the team. Just so if people don't know that Monday, what is it, the twenty sixth? He he came back to the team, trained with them. I didn't hear about how he trained, but as far as you hear the rumors, he's possibly staying just this year and then leaving. There's a possible extension, or there's still that possible move to PSG if Mbappe goes maybe a swap of Icardi for Ronaldo. Um, that's really the the sense of what I've heard. I mean, I had the Manchester United rumors have all dwindled. You don't hear that anymore. So that's that's what we're looking at, right? Basically, unless you guys – have you guys heard uh, that? If he goes, it's gonna, it's PSG. That's that's the only place he's going to go that's if he does leave. All so, to me, so to me – okay, so let's break it down for anyone that ha- maybe hasn't been following it, right? So from a Juventus standpoint, we have, we have the issue of – the pay, right? He gets paid 31 million euros net, right? After taxes. Um, Juventus obviously lost a ton of money with COVID, right? Um, he has one year left on his on his salary, uh, on his contract. And they were between trying to basically get him to take an extension to two years where they can lower it, 20 million and 20 million and yeah, try to lower that hit. But you, you say 31 million. You did say the, 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 the gross. Your gross is about 30 million. Seven sixty-five, yeah. eighty million. It's a lot. It's, yeah, it's, it's a, a, it's a, it's a, it's a ton that, of money, for it's sure. It's it's a ton of money. Um, so from a Juventus standpoint, it's clear that it, that's a big weight on them, right? Yes, he scored his forty goals, right? Um, he's Ronaldo, marketing dollars. I think Juventus is at the point where, unfortunately, they don't have the guts to straight up say like, "We want you to go." No, <laughs> no, 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 no. That's a nice. They I don't want so. to lose the thirty million. Minus for less. They what don't do you want mean to they want lose 30 million? If they don't sell him and get there, somebody give it 30 billion. What do you mean? Are you talking about next year or somebody just buys it? Oh, no, no. Yeah, that's what, he, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. They don't want to try not to lose 30 million. It's a, a mi- minus balance, you know? Yeah. Well, no, I get so that. If, but I think if but I think Ronaldo is playing them in a sense of he's very content to take his money this year. Run out of contract and then go right, where he wants right, to go. Right, right, right. But, but the whole thinking we know since the beginning, and this might be uh, till the end of August. In other words, they, they wait to Real Madrid to, to buy Mape. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Once they buy Mape, look, they take it, they take it. Look. If that happens. So Real, Real Madrid is trying to sell players. So part of me also, part of me also wonders with him, right? So PSG, if he wants to stay in Europe and right and have another experience, then it, that would make sense. Part of me also thinks, and I know it's an outside chance. Part of me also wonders if Ronaldo thinks I'll play this year at thirty million, and then at thirty-seven he'll be or thirty-eight. Oh, he's to thirty-seven now. So he'll be thirty-eight. Part of me wonders he goes, I'll go sign a three or four-year deal with the MLS. No. It's yeah, not enough I, money. It's not enough money. You don't understand. You, yes, Ronaldo, what do you mean it's not Ronaldo, enough money? They, they can't give him that money. There's Ronaldo, no way. With sponsors, yes, they can. Ronaldo, yeah, that's different. Ronaldo doesn't think to go MLS or Africa or China. He's still competitive. He wants a yeah. golden ball. The He's MLS, he the MLS, the MLS is not an option right now. It's I think a, I think he sees it as, hey, I can go to France and I can go to the top four divisions win a championship in every single league. Yeah. Like that that's his goal. I'm the best everywhere I went. And then also if he goes to PSG, he has a realistic, a huge shot of going and winning the Champions League. That's Yeah, but his I also best and I agree with that. I think it's I think in one or two years he would like to play in the next one or two years of PSG, but I still think in the back of his head, 
Ronaldo has a thing where I'll go to the MLS and I'll try to become a part owner somewhere. He will. I, I really, that's, I really that's do realistic. believe that. Not until he's forty years old, probably. Yeah, maybe at, if they're willing to take him at forty, right? You I was know, giving him some I, credit it's, and said we want to take him at thirty-eight. They will take him. Let me ask you something, Frank. Part of, you just mentioned a part owner. Yeah. You think a Baker would the Miami into Miami to make money? Yeah. 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 You think so? Do you know how much? Think- okay. So when MLS came out, the franchise fee was fifteen million dollars to start a team in MLS. Right. right? You know how much it is now? How much? It's five hundred million dollars just to I buy the know. rights to a team. I never mind the, 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 my mind to buy. Yes, because as you an know, owner, you, you as think, an owner, you get that you know, equity. No, Bacon has to pay. Iguain has to pay. Batuit has to pay the pay rest. Them. Where do you make? In. Where do they get all the spot? It's from broadcast rights and from sponsorship. Broadcast, just before the cast. And yeah. a, 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 a TV right, they make all the spot. Yes, they I do. Know. MLS makes money because they keep the salaries low. How many people are watching the MLS? Come yeah. on. Ronaldo goes there, you're going to be making a lot. They're on. Trust me, they're they're doing well. They make. Yes. That's why this. That's why the franchise went from 15 million to 500 million. Say what you want. They're making MLS. Money. You you think it's low quality, whatever. Like they know what they're doing. They're running the business well. So so they, when they know. started MLS, right? I hope. I, I hope. I hope so. I hope so. Because when I we were, think they can make a money with MLS. Listen, I know they, because when I was sure. at, when They're I was in right. college, right? We did a whole thing on this. The one thing MLS did was they set it up the way they set up the league with a sing, single entity because they didn't want to repeat the problems of the cosmos, right? Bringing all these players, not making enough money by setting up a single entity, and the league owns all the players. They kept the prices down. The league buys the players. The league sells the players. They're able to manage. The, the cost of most of the players. And then when they want to go out and buy a Ronaldo or a Beckham, they bring in some sponsor to put in a hundred million dollars for them. And it's nothing but broadcast rights back for them. They're making money. The, 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 the model makes sense. There's a team, the Columbus crew that joined the league not that many years yeah. ago with the, with the stadium new that stadium. they built and now built another new stadium. Yeah. The stadium was only like what? 20 years old, max? 20 years old. And they they're making money. money. They're, they make money. So th- don't question the finances. The finances are there. If you choose just yeah, to go I, there. I want to see fact. Let's just say a red bull. You think they make money with the team? Yeah. Yes. yes. I they think make money because they share revenue. They make money because of the, the 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 MLS the the broadcasting rats. They're making money. Red Bull own a stadium. You know they they get fans. They, they definitely make money. All the teams, most of the, I don't want to say all, but I would say most of the teams probably make money. Listen, FC Dallas yes. is making tons of money with their youth products. So. And listen, back to Ronaldo, right? I agree. Like if he had his choice, he'd probably rather go to PSG, compete at the highest level, right? Say, hey, I took on another country you know, cement his, his glory even more. I just don't know. Like, is PSG what? They're just collecting he, players? He won, he won in England. He won in Spain. Yeah. He won in Italy. Now, if you go to French, he yeah. went in France. Who, yeah, who, can, who can French and then, and then, and then, and then, I don't know if you go in Germany because in Germany, nah. you know. Yeah, but the thing is, too, is like no one questions his greatness to begin with. So, Oh, so Pond made a great a point here, which I think is, so this is the, he's put in the chat for people that can't see the chat. And, um, what, someone in the chat player. put, he's a bench player in PSG, which is debatable whether or not he is a bench player or not. But I don't the funny think thing, so. If, because if you go there, I'm a pace. Yeah, yeah, if Mbappe's guy, I don't think he's a bench player. Well, well and, it's and here, be Ronaldo, yeah. so, a, 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 but, a, a Neymar. but here's the thing. So, okay, if Mbappe leaves, right, that opens up more room for him. But the problem that we've been debating on Juventus, right, the problem with having Ronaldo is not that he's not a great player, not that he doesn't score his goals, is that when he's on your team, he cuts the power from the coach. Like if the coach wanted to take him out and put him on the bench, that's not even in play. Yeah, uh, you, see, you see, Frank, <laughs> that's you, see, you see, Frank, PCG, Paris Saint-Germain, German, he has a lot of money. They buy, they spend whatever they want. They buy whatever they want. But it look like they... You, you know, they buy figurines. You know what that means? The yeah, they name. collect them. Collect they, they, them all. They, they collect yeah. the name and put yeah. a na- beautiful name, 11. It's difficult. Because, yeah. you see, on the team, you need the people like Kelly. You need the people that run like yeah. McKinney. But here's, 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 here's the benefit, But here's the benefit. In France, in the French League, 
you could win with Neymar, Ronaldo, so a they, team that's very top. Yeah, they lost the championship. They didn't win. But most of the time, yeah. you can win that league. Most yeah, of the time, but you so win. what? You win the. It's like you say you went to win the Italian championship. But yeah. that said something already. We forgot about that. Yeah. But when I think that's the, the problem. That's, there's even more of a gap in France. That, that's yeah, yeah, there's more of a gap in France. This is, disparity is huge in, in that league. And that's why yeah, PSG doesn't do I'm that saying, win the, Champions League. Win the French Championship, it does do nothing to you. It builds his legacy even more. I mean, he cares about that stuff. So, so. Cool. No, legacy, bitch. does. Well, but like, <laughs> like so last year, he, he, he was a Cup Connery ride, he said, yeah. Yeah. So he did this, 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 this things. Yeah, I think he's ready yeah. to move on. And, I think he's done. End, let me say this. Juventus is not going to have a say in this. If he no. says, I yeah. want to go, he's going. Hey, if he says, I want to stay, Daniel, Daniel, he did whatever he did. But they all think that Juventus took him for to win the championship. The, the, uh, cha- he didn't win. Yeah, so, well, yeah. But they're not, they're not going to say that. Know, right? Hey, no. They all think Juventus got him just to win the and they don't spin it that way. They say we won the league. I won it twice. No, I did my no, job. no. We, listen, the Juventus would have won the championship without him at all. I agree, but yeah. he's not, he doesn't see it that way. And he's not listen. No, there's no doubt either. the mission. The mission on Juventus was yeah. to bring home the Champions League, right? They didn't win it, right? You need some luck. You need whatever. Also, don't forget he came for the fans, and then he got a year and a half of COVID, playing in front of nobody. Yeah, right. Nice. So it's not exactly at this point. I think he's run his three years, and he's kind of like I'm over it. I could, he has no attachment to Juventus, or he doesn't owe anything to them. The problem is Juventus is what Dan said. They're in the passenger seat. Oh, you want to stay? Okay, we'll keep you. Oh, you want to leave? Okay, we'll sell you. And that's I get it. It's Ronaldo, but I would never want to be there. A team like Juventus to be yeah, hostile. But that's like that. the bed you lay. Like you, you made that bed. Like you knew yeah. that's what you were getting yeah, they, like when you when you got him. Yeah, they knew that was going to happen, and yeah. th- there was more positives in him coming than hey, negatives. Hey, hey, what what do you what, what yeah. do you, what do you think Juventus even is in a hub because uh, to spend all that money, they 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 spend just to win the Champions League. Yeah, well, you they don't get spend one all that money like just to put the cha- cha- championship. But I think it's marketing dollars, the 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 yeah the, the popularity, the, yeah the branding, the global brand. It, it they got that back with Ronaldo, right? If it wasn't for no, Kobe, yeah, it could because uh, Juventus show he, Ronaldo came to play with Juventus. Anybody can come to play. Juventus. Well, that's the thing. It's Ronaldo. They got they got Ronaldo, but then it got them to get the lit, and then you hope that it gets them to get somebody else. Like yeah. that's that's yeah. the mentality that you want. You want to yeah. play, and, and not just for. Uh, Juventus, but other teams in Italy too, right? Italy, like, hey, yeah. Well, yeah, Ronaldo's there. Yeah. Let me go. You know. But here's the thing, though, with with these fair weather, like I would say, not like not like soccer fans who listen to soccer podcast and watch every game, right? But like the casual fan, the ten year old girl that doesn't even know what a soccer ball is, but knows who Ronaldo is, and now all of a sudden she knows who Juventus is. When play, they follow the player. The star. Oh, listen, like once they listen, leave, they're gone. Like they're I not going to be loyal to Juventus. I was in the. Um, I was listening to. I was watching the the Juventus friendly, and it was on the Facebook page of something. And one guy in the chat wrote, "Oh no, Ronaldo! I'm not watching." And he left the <laughs> media. Like obviously, yeah. that's going to happen. Yeah. Whatever. You don't want those fans anyway. Who cares? Like, <laughs> well, yeah. that, I mean, the whole idea is to grow the brand, right? Otherwise, really, if your only mission was to win the Champions League, then it was yeah, not yeah, a failure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By Ronaldo, not. And the, the fan, the one who know Saka, he know Ronaldo is not himself no more. Yeah, I think anyone, anyone. They, they know um, it, but he's still a useful uh, player. And, and that yeah, being said, yeah. what did he have? Thirty-five goals, thirty-seven goals. Last I think year? he had thirty-six well, goals and like, five assists last year. Like you can like say that. he's not the same player, but he's still the, one of the best players. Yeah, I know. Uh, when you talk, you see people sometimes talk just a goal, some goal mm-hmm. anybody could make when they give the ball to him. They just stay score. The penalty is score. You know, think about the bad things. Since he went there, how many a free kick he, he, he just did one goal yeah, with the free there's kick. There's negatives. He there's, took away yeah. from the ball, from the piano, from everybody. Yeah. yeah. Look. And the ball, don't forget, the ball was was to do the penalty too before him. He also scored some ridiculous goals too. Uh, Listen, he scores his goals. You can't say, like, he keeps himself in shape despite his age. I did see a little decline this year, I felt like, in terms of the, yeah, I don't know Frank, if he lost Frank, some desire. Frank, it's a relative because if we look at the whole thing, right? 
if you think the all playing time he has compared to the other people, the all uh, advantage he has compared to the whole team. That's why he has to to make that money. He has to to show up better yeah. than the other people. Well, I will say this though: the way Ronaldo is wired, right? There's no doubt that he cares about. He's very professional. He wants to be the best. He doesn't give anything. I think to see Ronaldo go back to as close to his top as he could be. I think a move to PSG is what he needs because Ronaldo is the type where he puts on a new uniform. He wants to prove it to a new fan base. He gets excited again, right? And he's going to have a crazy good year. I think the difference of a, no- a year number one in a uniform like PSG versus a year number four in Juventus is going to be very different. I think he's going to be good regardless. So. From a motivation standpoint, I think you're going to get that extra little gear by him playing on another team. I really do. Um, just to throw another jab at Inter fans, PSG had their first friendly. Hakimi scored. Just wanted to throw that in there. He's going to have 20 plus goals for PSG. This yeah, not, not, that one, not that one. It's not the one like Dana Roma, which uh, 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 I like to be with PSG. You know, he already deny deny Inter. <laughs> he forgot he was a player with Milan. He's got a short memory. Short memory, right? Yeah. Anyway, I think that's enough on Ronaldo. Like, so, so let's just talk about let's in the end. Let's make a call. Do you think he stays or you think he goes? I think he stays. Stays. What He's do you think? Gone. I think. It's, what do you think, Bob? You think he's staying or going? I don't know. It's fifty-fifty because all depends on my pay. Yeah, I agree with that. I think he'll stay if the spot if the opportunity doesn't open up for him. But if it opens up for him, I think he chooses to go. Yep. Um, Fair enough. I think you know we'll get obviously more answers. Because you those. see, PCG, if my pay go, PCG wants to compete. And yeah, they're going to pounce on it. Yeah.